Hello everyone, Felix here and welcome back to another video on this channel. Um, today's video we're going to be doing a review of the 11th Doctor's Sonic Screwdriver TV remote. I'm not going to be turning it on today, but I'll just be showing you what it looks like basically. So, here is a screwdriver. Um, sorry, it's quite dark. Um, it gets dark this time of year, so you know, that's my excuse. <laughs> okay, so we'll start at the top. There's a green LED, um, not LED, sorry, infrared thing, and you can see it, see it there. Well, that's where the um, signals come out to the TV. You got the claws, or I think they, I don't know what they are, but the claws or something like that. Um, that's sort of I think that's metal. Um, you move down. You've got the plates here. It's a real, it's a real nice. It's definitely, it's quite heavy, and this is sort of what a sonic screwdriver would look like in the show, I guess. Um, a lot more than the character options version. The only thing is on this one, um, this little ring here, which you can unscrew. This is how you take the batches out. Um, on the actual screwdriver, that isn't just straight like that. It sort of has a slant, more of a slant to it. Um, the leather bit down there, I'm not really, I think it's just plastic. I'm not too sure it could be leather. I don't think so, though. And then we have the white. The white thing there, whatever it is. Uh, then we have a nice little cap, and then the on button. Actually, I will turn it on. So you got... I'll go into the FX mode. If you push it forward... Uh, oh, this is some kind of hard to use. Put it back, you get that. So yeah, if you push it forward, you get that. You pull it back, you get that. Swipe it to the right, you get that. Swipe it to the left. Um, to the left, you get that. Up, you get that. Down, you get that. So you twist it to the right. Oh no, you get that, which is um, you get this if you twist it to the right and left. Tap on the top. Um, it's just really hard to use. Bottom, left, and right. I don't think that's right. Is that right? No, yeah, that's the right. Um, it cannot extend. I believe the top doctors one. I'm going to turn this off now because it will irritate me. The 12th Doctor's one can extend, um, but yeah, this one can't. It does come with a stand normally, which is pretty cool. It has some Gallifreyan symbols, it's got some Ys there. Let me just move this so you can see. Screwdriver fits on the stand, and then it has. Is that right? I think it's meant to be the other way. That looks better. And it has a glass case like that. So yeah, if you did enjoy today's review, please make sure to leave a like, because it does help out the channel a lot. And I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.